Centuries ago, when pirates roamed the seas in search of plunder, an island off the shore of present-day New Jersey became a popular pirate's haven. Hidden in the back bay, the Jolly Rogers lay in wait for unsuspecting merchant vessels passing on the open sea. It is on this island that Captain Kidd purportedly buried his treasure. And the shoals off its shore were feared by every ship captain that ever sailed the Atlantic coast. Over 300 ships have gone down there since the early 1700s. From this lusty and romantic heritage, the island takes its name. A two-masted square-rigged ship is called a brigantine. And Brigantine Beach Island is still today New Jersey's best kept secret. Although Brigantine Beach Island is a bustling, well-designed seaside community today, active development only began on the island about a hundred years ago. In 1897, portions of the present street system were established. A railroad connecting the island to Philadelphia was built and a trolley line ran the length of the island, providing transportation to the few homes, beach cottages, and three large frame hotels, the Holland House, the Holdscombe House, and the Smith House that existed at the time. In 1903, catastrophe struck. The railroad was washed out and ceased operation, and development of the island stopped for close to 20 years. In 1919, the Island Development Company, headed by Howard G. Harris, purchased most of Brigantine Beach Island. Thus began the largest seashore development project ever recorded in the state. Aside from installing miles of streets, curbs, sidewalks, sewer, and water lines, constructing homes, recreational facilities, and public buildings, they closed the ocean inlets between Brigantine and the smaller islands widening and deepening the small waterway on the west side of the new development and pumped millions of cubic yards of sand onto the newly enlarged island, raising the average grade for safety and engineering purposes approximately eight feet. Residents of the island are still reaping the benefits of this massive development effort today. Because of the higher grade level, flood insurance rates are lower for Brigantine Beach Island than for any other shore community in the state. Today, Brigantine Beach Island is one of the fastest growing family resorts in New Jersey, with approximately 12,000 year-round residents. In the summertime, lured by the island's wide sandy beaches, some of the widest in the state, clean water, and an array of family-oriented activities, the influx of tourists almost doubles the population. Brigantine Beach Island's bay water is the cleanest in the state. So clean, in fact, that in 1977, the Marine Mammal Stranding Center was established here. The center assists injured and stranded marine mammals and sea turtles all along the Atlantic shore. The Brigantine Beach Island location was chosen because the bay water was clean enough to be pumped into the tanks where injured or sick sea creatures were being tended without the need for elaborate filtration systems. At 26th Street on the bay is City Docks. Here you'll find the only bayside beach along the Jersey Shore. This is also where the children are taught to swim. Swimming lessons given for a very nominal fee affirm the island philosophy that all children living near the water should know how to swim. The rowing club, also on the bay, offers both adult and youth programs in the summer. Over the years, rowing teams from this secluded island have been champions both in this country and abroad. At the north end of the island is two miles of natural beach, which separates the developed part of the island from the Brigantine Forsyth Wildlife Refuge. Here, 10,000 acres of salt and freshwater pools and marshland have been preserved for the purpose of maintaining our wildlife, migrating birds, and waterfowl. Of course, Brigantine Beach Island's greatest natural resource is the mighty Atlantic Ocean. With miles of gently sloping beaches, it offers a myriad of activities for those who love the water. Whether it's surfing, sailing, water skiing, 
or boating that suits your fancy, you'll find it here. If fishing is your favorite pastime, Brigantine Beach Island has it all. The ocean, the bay, or cast your line off the jetty. For land lovers, there's tennis and softball at the island's new recreation center. The center also has a playground for tots and a gazebo where outdoor concerts are held on Sunday evenings throughout the summer. If golf is your sport, Brigantine Beach Island has the first and only golf course on a Jersey Shore island. Built in 1927 by the Island Development Company, this 18-hole course is popular with residents and tourists alike. For the glitz and glamour of a night on the town, just across the bridge, the casinos and shows of Atlantic City await those in search of an evening of sophisticated excitement. Perhaps you'd enjoy a pleasant afternoon strolling through historic Smithville, just minutes away on the mainland. Or take the kids to Tivoli Pier, a Disney-like theme park at Atlantic City's Trop World. Yes, Brigantine Beach Island has a lot to offer, and it's only an hour from Philadelphia, two and a half hours from New York, and three and a half hours from Washington, D.C. An ideal location for a second home or a summer vacation, the island offers some of the most affordable housing along the shore. Along with hotel, motel, and timeshare accommodations, there are single-family homes, condos, and townhomes available. Many new construction projects are underway. Here on Brigantine Beach Island, families can spend the lazy days of summer in style and comfort. Fine restaurants offer excellent cuisine and magnificent ocean views. Dance all night at one of the local discos. Indeed, everything you need, whatever your lifestyle, can be found within the boundaries of this six and a half square mile island. Fast food restaurants, convenience stores, groceries and supermarkets, shops and boutiques which offer merchandise and services of every description. And now, the Brigantine Town Center, a large modern shopping center is under construction. On Sundays, families attend religious services on the island, Catholic, Jewish, and most of the Protestant denominations have churches here. Not as well known as some of the other shore towns, Brigantine Beach Island is still New Jersey's best kept secret. One of the loveliest of barrier islands, its well kept streets, wide sandy beaches, clean water, and small town atmosphere make it an ideal place for families to live or spend the summer. 